Thank you for coming. We're on the 11th episode right now. How's it going? Having a good time. It's going well. No, no fights outbreaking yet. <laughs> That's is that a new thing or did I, I don't know. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just being funny. You're stirring the pot, Colin. Yes, he is. Uh, it's been good. Uh, 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 you know, we're coming up on. Uh, you know, the one thing they've been saying this year is that we'll get all the answers by the end of end of the season. We don't have them yet, so we kind of find out episode by episode the way the audience does. So we're excited to kind of see how all of this uh, comes about. Mackenzie will come up to me, who plays Nori, and she'll go, Oh my god, Colin, I just got the next episode. Oh, it's so good. We do this, that, and the other. I'm like, okay, all right, all right, all right. Let me take a look. She's always the first one to read it. So I know she's really excited. And she always reads them on the slide, too. Yes, like on set. Like, we'll get them on set, be working on an episode. Well, she reads she, the, the hair and makeup ones. Oh, yeah. The she'll department like, heads get them before we do. Yeah. So she'll, like, read them first and spoil everything for me. So it's... Not as exciting right when I get to read it, but it's still pretty, pretty, pretty but exciting. But she has, she's enthusiastic. Yes, yeah. she's very enthusiastic <laughs> about getting that script. Yeah, it's cute. <laughs> well, uh, it's, you know, coming in on a, a, a third season of a show that's um, already established and has a lot of fans. I mean, you know, it's, I'm always a little bit, like, reluctant, but, I, I, you know, that was dissipated as soon as I walked on the set. Everybody was super, you know, welcoming towards me and friendly, and, you know, uh, there wasn't any sort of friction or anything, you know. It was really nice. Um, and Neil, who I've known, Neil Bear, who was the co-showrunner uh, co on the show, has, I've known for many years, and he and Tim conceived of this character with me in mind, which is always so flattering to hear that, and um, it just sounded like something I couldn't say no to. It was just, uh, uh, you know, a character that had, you know, complex is sort of an understatement, and it was uh, allowing me to get back into Stephen King territory, and it's always fun, because I think he always explores, like, the dark darker side of humanity and uh, which we're clearly doing on this season and I think that uh, so a lot more character stuff is in addition to the you know more, more getting back into the sci-fi genre so I think I could speak for everybody here I think we're having a lot more fun with the characters and um, yeah. Uh, I mean, uh, yeah. Uh, it, it's it's you know it's been it's it's kind of been business as usual for us just the, as the until we get down to these last couple ones where we're really going to get some some answers. I mean, I, we're re all really excited for the for the uh, I think the, the the two hour premiere that we filmed this year. Getting getting to live life for a little bit outside the dome was really exciting. Um, and uh, and we're excited to see where things go if they go anywhere past this season. They've got a lot of really cool ideas. So, well, some of us or a lot of us weren't at the panel. What, what were you excited to hear about the panel? That's, that, that about you mean the questions that were asked by the moderator or well, by whatever you feel? Like I went at the panel, so I don't know what you feel. You know. Uh, I, I can't even think back that far. I know. Yeah, yeah, it's so <laughs> run together now. Um, uh, noon today. I think, I think that, uh, you know, we'll see love triangles play out between he and Nori and Hunter and me and Julia and, uh, and Ava, and, uh, which may result in a, a, a little, little baby, little baby coming into the world, little dome baby. Um, and uh, uh, we'll kind of see these two factions that, that, that Marg kind of helps facilitate come to a head. Um, and at the end of it all, uh, it'll end with the answer, like we said, the answers that people have been asking for the last three years all being, an all being answered. Um, I'm sure it will ask more questions. Um, 
But, yeah, yeah, no, no, please. It's just to see on the road to those questions being answered, you get to see a lot of like really fascinating scenes that t transpire. I haven't seen any of the stuff that you guys um, shot, but in this reading, there's some really cool, interesting scenes between Julia and Barbie, and, and Joe's got some really great stuff. So we and I have, yeah, we and, and um, you know, because I have a firm belief in his abilities as a, as an inventor and as an engineer, and you know, Joe's going to play in a, a major, you know, role in the dome coming down. That's all I'll say. Yeah. And how did this is your character? Is everything what she sees in your character, and how much funny have you played? Uh, well, no, not everything. No, she. What you see isn't what you get. That's for sure. Um, you know, there's a lot of complexity to her, <laughs> and. Um, I, I'm having a great deal of fun playing her. It's always fun to play characters that um, are mysterious, and um, she's, uh, you know, uh, her darker side, it, you know, gets revealed in, in mysterious ways and unexpected ways, and that's always fun.